Two bodies were found in a burnt vehicle on St. Croix recently, and now we have video from the incident to share with you. VIPD Chief Detective Naomi Joseph tells us about that suspicious case. Good day. I am Naomi Joseph. I'm the Chief of Detective for the Virginia Police Department, St. Croix District. We're here um, at Good Hope, the old campus for the school where on Friday, unfortunately, we discovered a vehicle with two burnt individuals in it. At this time, we're investigating the matter as a homicide, only because we don't believe the individual drove themselves here and set themselves on fire. So we're investigating it as a homicide, but we cannot verify who the individuals are because of how badly burnt they were. So we're now Getting ready to do a topsy um, this week. Um, hopefully, by before the end of the week, we should have a topsy. And once that is done, then we'll take whatever sample in from the from the individual bodies. At the same time, we also had families that reported individuals missing. So we have gotten samples from those individuals to compare with the remains that we found in the car to verify whether or not the individuals in the car are in fact the individual that have been reported missing. So it's a process and we cannot today, the 26th of August say that the persons in the vehicle were in fact the individual who have been reported missing on Saturday the 24th. So at this time, um, we're asking the community for any information that they may have regarding the two individuals who's been reported missing. If you know their whereabouts, if you know who they were with um, when they left their homes on Friday, if you know anything about um, what they were driving, what they were doing, anything whatsoever that would allow us to piece it together and then with some certainty say, yes, this is who we are looking at uh, that was in the vehicle. We do know that um, one of the individual is a, the alleged person of interest for a homicide that occurred downtown Frederick said earlier last week in which Mr. Janai Hamilton was shot dead. So we, we believe that one of the individuals who reported missing may have in fact been involved in that particular case. So there is allegation out here in the community that this is a retaliation for that. But at this time, I cannot say, my detective cannot say that the person that we have in the morgue is in fact the individual who was reported missing. So we're just asking again for your help. Um, what you know could help us, could help our family bring closure. Um, if, if you know for sure that the person was driving a certain vehicle, that they were with a particular person or they went to see a particular person, please share that information with us. That would allow us to get to who, what, where, why. And that would help us to bring closure to two families. Community, please reach out. If you know something, say something. Please call 1-800-222-TIPS or 911 or 712-6092. Any information, what you, whatever you gave us will remain confidential and it would help us bring closure to these families. Thank you very much.